What you writing? Working on my five-year plan. Got to set goals to achieve them. Ooh, what have you got so far? Five years from today, I will have a pimp and crib in Beverly Hills, a trophy wife, three immaculately dressed children, and a holiday villa in Tuscany. Hmm. What if that doesn't happen? <laughs> Mate. If that doesn't happen, I will change my name to Loser McWankington and play the bagpipes out my ass. Okay, yep. Um, <clears throat> maybe you want to aim a little lower to start with. Uh, what do you suggest? Well, maybe a small fibro shack in Tasmania, a date with the lady that works at the post office, and a packet of salt and vinegar crisps. Yeah, it's not really what I had in mind. Well, you've got to be realistic. I mean, look at my five-year plan, for example. You don't have one. Exactly. So I'll never be disappointed. Well, you'll also never feel the warm caress of the LA sunset as your buxom wife fellates you on the balcony of your pimp and crib. Pimp and cribs don't come cheap, Sammy. How much cash you got? A cool 12.7 mil. What? Obviously slightly less with the exchange rate, but I'm still looking at a pretty sweet crib. Where did you get 12.7 mil from? I found a trophy wife. She's been bankrolling me. Really? Yeah. Well, the money hasn't started coming through yet, uh, because she had a few medical expenses which I had to cover, and I was happy to, but her Nigerian uncle is recently deceased and has leave her a mighty fortune, and so long as I continue to provide for her in interim, she be reward me handsomely. Sammy, you've been scammed. Scammed by love? Yes. Scammed by love and taken for a fool? Exactly! Scammed by love, taken for a fool, played like a fiddle and left without a penny? Yep. Yeah, when I say it out loud, it's pretty clear I've been screwed. Mm. So what now, loser McWankington? Fetch me my bagpipes. <laughs>